Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing all super well today. In today's video, I'm gonna to share with you some items that I have purchased in the past couple of weeks. So make yourself comfortable and without any further ado, let's get started. First of the item is from Balmain. It's this lovely denim dress. It is not too short, not too long. It's the last collection. It is in this gorgeous pink color. As you may all know, my favorite color. With the denim dress, you can't do anything wrong, especially for summer. It's got the white stitching, silver hardware. As you can see, it opens and closes with a zipper at the back. It is denim combination cotton with elastan doesn't have too much stretch but it is still comfortable i am regular size 38 from balman and this is no difference just letting you know at the end of the video every single item shown in this video will be shown as well how i would style it so keep watching otherwise you can subscribe to my instagram and see all items there another item from balman and the same collection are uh, these denim pants they are high-waisted with the logo at the back and yeah they are skinny and for the first time actually I haven't had to tailor these pants so the length is great and for your info I am 172 centimeter tall also they are in French size 38 Continuing, and I promise there are only two items from this collection, is this simple pink t-shirt. I love the fact that the logo is just uh, really small on this left side. I mean, it's very simple and casual t-shirt. I'm intending of wearing it with a white denim or denim shorts. This one is in size small and it is a little bit oversized. Next item is from Philosophy. I came across it by accident browsing the Farfetch website. I love the fact that it matches the exact color like the Balmain denim and it's got the white hem around which I thought would be a great match. It's got a uh, cashmere in it so it has really nice feel to it. I would highly recommend. This is in size 36. The next and last item I promised from Balmain is this blazer. It is also denim, a little bit stiffer, but still very comfortable. It doesn't have any underlay, so very simple, a size 38. Also the white stitching, silver hardware. I mean, I've got a lot of Balmain blazers and I just love them. I mean, the fit is amazing and I don't think they will ever get out of style. Uh, the next item is from Prada and I couldn't help myself again with the pink it's this nylon shoulder bag re-edition in pink color it is all over social media and i love it too the reason why i got it was that when the louis vuitton multi pochette came on the market i got it i didn't think i would love it as much as i do because i was when i got it i was wearing it like nearly every day and I think it's a perfect bag, especially for traveling. I'm doing a lot of motorbike trips, so the bag is really great because through the day I can wear it crossbody in the evening. I can take off the big strap and I can just carry it as a little bag. When Prada came up with this pink color, I thought I really have to have it. I wore it for the time being, not as a shoulder bag, but as a top help bag and yeah very simple like you can use it every day it's really cute i have nothing bad to say about it and definitely would recommend it even the price point is really good one more item from prada come in this big box and they are sneakers they never came in australia in this color so i had to really chase them down i found them in italy this sneaker be careful it's not everyone's cup of tea it is really casual and i really love them they remind me of balenciaga that <laughs> chunky sneakers when they came out i thought i would get them but i actually did i 
couldn't walk in them more than half an hour they are really really heavy whoever thinks that the balenciaga are heavy guys check these out they are really really light and very very comfortable i got these in size 37 and a half prada has a really weird sizing i've got shoes from them from 37 and a half to 38 and a half so you really really have to check the sizing and uh, yeah look at the match love them so this is it another two items are from louis vuitton and this little item i was browsing the website came to my attention comes in this little dust bag and it is the little card holder and i really love the reverse monogram i do not own too many card holders or wallets because i'm not a person who would change every single day wallets or card holders yeah i thought uh, this color would be really nice for cooler months and very simple i mean it has the main compartment and card pocket on each side and yeah that's it i really like canvas coating from louis vuitton especially in the smaller the goods you can't really destroy them love it the next item from louis vuitton is this leather skirt from the current collection i really adore this skirt i love leather first of all and secondly i really like the fact that it is sort of the faded logo i'm not sure if you can see it it is a great length and i think the style is really flattering and it is in size 36 I'm sometimes 36 or 38 in Louis Vuitton, it really depends on the cut and on the style. The skirt was really weird because I fit in 34, but I just don't like too tight things. I like it a little bit looser, so that's why I went for 36. The next item is from this new designer that I came across a couple months ago and I really fall in love with her. It's from Ulla Johnson and the first item from her are this like uh, dark grey pants, high-waisted, it is actually denim material, hinge at the bottom and yeah you can tie it up at the waist, I mean they are really nice, they are 99% a cotton, 1% elastin but still quite elastic but you don't need it because they are quite loose and the fit is really amazing, love them, would recommend them to anyone because I got them in several colors and I wear them quite often. These are in size American 4 and I would say they fit true to size. The next item from Ulla Johnson is this beautiful jumper. It's got like high neck and exaggerated shoulders that are so fashionable. It's um, really beautiful on as you will see it later on in the video and uh, yeah i wore it already several times and i got so many compliments every single time i wore it and look at the colors i mean aren't they gorgeous pink blue orange yellow really beautiful it's like heavy wool so i usually wear this with a with a gray denim and it just look good i got this in size small again i would say it fits through to size the next item is from frankie shop which is Currently so trendy and fashionable, especially these padded shoulders. I mean, it's a simple singlet, but it makes such a statement. Love it, you can dress it up or down. I got it in several colors. This is size small and it is a little bit oversized. So if you like it a little bit fitted, go one size smaller. But I think it should be oversized. So especially for high-waisted pants or skirt, it looks really cool on. The next item and the last item is from the brand that I've never purchased before, Off-White, but this uh, denim caught my attention especially because of the color. I thought for summer the light denim would be really nice and these cutouts that are so unusual. They are straight leg and they are 100% cotton, so but not too stiff. They've got beautiful like zipper and the weird thing only is the sizing because I'm regular size 26. Uh, if it's 100% cotton, I usually take 27. These I had to size them up to 25. So the sizing is really weird, but definitely try them on or 
go two sizes down or at least one. I ordered it matching singlet for summer, white with the cutout at the back and I will show it to you when it arrives. I think I like some items from this brand are really nice and just funky, different, so would recommend. In this outfit I have pair the off-white denim with the Frankie singlet and Bottega Veneta mules and finish with Chanel boy handbag in medium size. The off-white denim is in size 25 as said in a video they do run large so size down at least one size. The Frankie top is in size small and can be nicely styled with any high waisted denim or high waisted skirt obviously the whole outfit can be styled down with sneakers in this look i have styled a balmain dress with the vanilla shoes in pink color as well as prada nylon shoulder bag reissue in pink color I did have forgotten to unbox for you in this video these uh, shoes. There are also a new addition. If you have watched my previous uh, shopping haul video, I did unbox other pair of Wendler shoes in different color and I did mention that they are so comfortable that I'm gonna to get uh, different colors. These are uh, in size 38, so they do run half a size small. Uh, the heel is 85 a millimeter and they are super comfortable. This look uh, can be styled with any white color shoes and a handbag just to bring up the color of the stitching of the dress. Here I have styled the Balmain dress with more dressier shoes from Dolce Gabbana and Bottega Veneta shoulder pouch in a burgundy color. As you can see, the color of the bag is nicely picked up in the shoes. They have the same sort of burgundy color. This is more for going out look. And final look of the dress is very casual look. Uh, here the Balmain dress is paired with Prada nylon shoulder bag reissue wearing crossbody as well as Prada sneakers. The sneakers are not everyone's cup of tea. They are a bit chunky but they are so light and super super comfortable. They do run through size. You can definitely pair this dress with simple white sneakers that everyone has in their wardrobe and it would just look super cute for summer. Another casual look here is composed of a Balmain denim and a Balmain t-shirt with the Prada sneakers and Prada nylon shoulder bag reissue, a wearing crossbody. Both Balmain pieces are in French size 38 and uh, from my experiences they do run through to size. For your info I am 172 cm tall. You can change the sneakers for simple white sneakers and any white bag would nicely line up with this look. In this look I have styled the Louis Vuitton leather skirt with Louis Vuitton blouse, Bottega Veneta mules and finish with Louis Vuitton Petit Mal clutch. The skirt is in French size 36 and the blouse in French size 38. 
to achieve more street style look i would combine this skirt with a black combat boots as well as a chunky knit on a top and it would look good for the last look i have paired ulla johnson denim with her knit but for pop of color i have paired this look with bright pink boots from rag and bone they are my favorites for winter i have them in several colors and i can just recommend them because they are really really comfortable and i have finished this look with prada nylon shoulder bag reissue in pink color as well That's it from today's haul. I hope you enjoyed it. If you've got any questions, please leave them in the comment box down below. I hope you liked even the styling session. And thank you so much for watching and I really hope to see you in my next video. Have a lovely day. Take care. Ciao.